So I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna splice this with the video where I was checking it. The video wasn't that great. This is the purge solenoid for the uh, evaporative emission system. This was the cause for that code, the P0455. I suppose it could do the P0456 and what was it P0457, 442? I don't know. Anyways. I'm just curious to see what it, I guess it's probably just like a plunger that opens and closes, allowing <coughs> the uh, the flow uh, from the charcoal canister into the engine. But uh, I'm just curious to see what it looks like, really. So what I want to do is just cut it open. Uh, I'm wearing safety glasses. I think what I should do is uh, I'm going to cut it. I'm going to cut right here first. bad for you. I cannot see. Hold on. There you go, that's better. Piece comes off. That piece comes off. The piece flew off to the side. Let me grab it. This piece was right here. Little filter, I guess. Let's see. I'm gonna cut a little bit more right here. guys I I took that out the trash can somebody threw it away somebody told me you uh you take that to the fire department or something like that 
and uh, I asked them what they do at the fire department, and they say they burn it, some kind of ritual or something. But uh, enemies of America burn our flags, and I guess to get rid of the old ones, we do too. I may be wrong, so please correct me if I'm wrong. But I use them though. I use them. To, um, actually, I use one of them to cover my. Uh, I use one of them to cover my uh, welder. There's channels that lock them. O-ring. See if we can't get this fully apart. I'll just keep cutting terminal connections. I could fill it wanting to come out. But we <clears throat> Yeah, there we go. It's just the cover. There we go. Maybe just moves inside. Just blowing air through it. You know what? Let's take these tabs off right here. We'll just cut them off. That's what's going to create the magnetic field. See the copper inside? This is nothing, just part of the connection. You can see though, from from the uh, vapors passing through, it just gets old and uh, defective, and it's supposed to be closed in its 
non-energized -energi state, and I think it seals right here, if you can see, right here would be unsealed. And then when it sits down, I think this rubber right here seals right here. See how like, when it's, when it's up like this, it'll allow it to go through when it's in its natural state it's supposed to be closed well this seal around here um, it just gets old and worn out and just like any other plastic any other rubber it uh, loses its sealing effect so pretty much that's probably what happens it's just go in and out small amount this probably moves sealing it and closing it like I said I may be wrong about that too so I just thought it was interesting just to see what this would look like on the inside <laughs> hell this thing still probably works we could we could put a power on the ground here make this a little magnet you could probably magnetize like your screwdrivers anyways thanks for watching comment rate subscribe